Hello YouTube. During a project, in the middle of a project, I decided to go ahead and do something that we did on our old RV, and that is mount a Level Mate Pro. What have you been up to? I've been riding on a daydream. A lot of you are probably thinking, well, why would you do that? If you're familiar with the Rockwoods, their fifth wheels, they come with the ground control, the 3.0 ground control that's self-leveling. Well, the reason you want that Level Mate Pro, there's, there's two things. The ground control don't necessarily tell you what your hitch height was whenever you disconnected. Um, that's something the Level Mate Pro does. It's really nice. Uh, now this is something that we bought for the last one. We bought it for this one, too, uh, immediately. The other thing is if I'm pulling into Walmart, if I'm pulling in to anywhere for that matter, all I got to do in this case is open the uh, propane door here, reach in and flip the switch, you get that beep. Then you open up the app. I don't have to unlock a bay to turn it on. Uh, on our old RV, I used to have to open this bay, which it was a swing door, reach in and flip a switch and uh, do it that way. There's something that I just did. You can go watch that video if you want. That's for the LED lights. The ground control system does a very good job of leveling, but it only can do so much. So you want to try to get as level as possible beforehand. So if I'm hooked up to my truck and I'm pulling in a spot and I'm wanting to know, okay, well, am I too high? It seems like I'm level. It looks like I'm level. All I've got to do is hop out of the truck, open this up, flip the switch on, open up the app, and it will tell me how off I am <laughs> or you can ask my wife she'll tell you how off I am <laughs> but it'll tell uh, me how off the RV is from being level and I can drive forward back side whatever I can do side you want to see some side driving <laughs> but I can you know do whatever I need to do to make it more level than um, you normally would prior to uh, just coming back and unhooking and trying to level so it's a very nice piece of equipment to have it's not very expensive and it's so easy to mount go back and check out my video on that um, you've seen how it was mounted in there you you just have to have the arrows pointed up and on a wall that is straight up and down it can be this way it can be you know mounted on a wall that's that way it, it can be mounted pretty much in, in on any wall just as long as it's straight up and down um, and the arrows are pointing up on the device uh, once you learn level which you very easy to do again go back and check out my video on that um, from when we did it with the travel trailer you just take some measurements in this case from the center of the leveling jack and um, the uh, rear axle the center of the rear axle you put in that dimension you put in your width dimension and uh, yeah, that's it I, I know this is something that you guys may or may not really care about but, you know, if you have multiple choices to park it into a spot, if you can, you know, go further back or pull for, further up, you have the room on your site to do so, or be closer to the power pole, further from the power pole. A lot of the sites you do, you have a lot of room. Like this one, I could go further back. I could come up, hell, I could come up a good six feet there. So if I know that it's more level out here than back there, then that Level Mate Pro will tell me just that and allow me to make adjustments or park it in a spot that'll be easier once you're all set up now you know the next line it's the same line I say all the time no it's not the one about wanting to see you out here of course that's the case it's the other one the links are in the description below and as always hope to see you out here bye